Hello everybody, welcome back to another Stable Diffusion video. We're doing some AI today and I want to show you the new 2.2 or what's tentatively titled XL or SDXL. It's now available for testing. Of course, it's being tweaked and tuned and all that good stuff, so it's not final and ready. But you can access it now and start testing it out and seeing what you think. In my personal opinion, it's great. It's got, it's much quicker. It creates images a lot faster than previous versions. And it just looks really, really good. And it looks like it's intelligent in terms of it can determine if you're looking for like, if I put in cute dog, it'll give me a cartoon. But if I type in attractive woman, it'll give me a photorealistic style. So it seems to have some, some thinking behind it. But let's just not get ahead of ourselves. First off, if you want to access it and use it out, you can go to dreamstudio.ai. In particular, you want to go to their beta dreamstudio.ai. I will put a link in the description below. You'll have to sign in if you have an account. If you don't, you can just sign up and it is free. I believe you get 100 tokens, which is the equivalent of about 500 image generations on the house. So you shouldn't run out in any time soon, especially if you're just testing it out. Okay, once you're in, you'll see just like this screen here on the left side, you'll see SDXL beta preview. This is the version that we want to work with. Now, of course, there's 1.5, 2.1, and then now 2.1-768, which is a little bit of a bigger image size, and now the beta, the XL, or the 2.2. Now, I've gone ahead and selected that. Now, all you got to do is type in a prompt right here. It comes with a prompt already pre-built, so we'll just go with whatever it's got there. And then more important, and very importantly, at the top here, you can also see that we can select a style. So it defaults to the enhanced style. So these are kind of just like, you know, add-on styles. But I'm going to go ahead and turn all the styles off, and I'm going to show you just how good this is. So all you got to do now is click on Dream, and it's going to create four images for us. So do keep in mind that because it's in beta, you can only create uh, lower res 512 by 512 images. But hey, that's life. So uh, there we go. We've got a rash rushing rapids and a crystal clear river surrounded by towers and trees and lots of vegetations. Okay. And it gave us these four pretty cool cartoony styles. Now watch this though. I'm going to change the prompt and I'm going to make it something simple. Attractive woman. This is completely different than the, the uh, longer prompt that we just did. I'm going to change nothing else except the prompt. Now watch what happens here. And this is why 2.2 or XL kind of interests me. Because it's going to go ahead now and give us photorealistic style. I'm virtually certain of it. Yes, see? I am right. Okay, good. Okay, well these two are kind of blurry and I don't... I don't think I've been drinking, so okay, well, whatever. Um, but look at this. I mean, this looks like a Amber Heard slash Miley Cyrus before they met Johnny Depp kind of look here. Very, very impressive. Like for photorealism, this is fantastic. Also look over here on the right side. You'll see that it says Stable Diffusion XL Beta V2 2.2, which basically means that it's version 2.2. That's my understanding. I'll click on this one here. And again, very, very good. Of course, you can go ahead and you can set the, you can generate variations. I'll go ahead and do that just for giggles. And of course, you can download it. So I'm going to download this pretty girl here. And maybe I'll download this pretty girl here. And then I'm going to click on this one to see what the heck. Okay, yeah, see, this this didn't go so well. I, I Guys, this, this is... This is me on a Friday night. Uh, that's usually what I see. Um, <clears throat> but there you go. So this is how good it is. I'm not going to waste your time trying out all the different prompts. I want you to experiment with it. Let me know what you think. I think it's great. I think it's gotten a lot smarter so it knows what you're trying to do. And of course, you can always go ahead and add in different styles to it. So if you want it to be comic book style, you can just click on Dream. And now we're going to have an attractive woman in a comic book style. 2.2 is here. Try it out. It's free to test. I think it's great. Let me know what you think. Thanks for watching.